Alright guys, I've got a phone holder for my um, for the Yamaha. Let's see what this is like. Crow's foot. Crow foot. It's supposed to be pretty good. This is the, I um, don't know what they're called, C clamps or whatever, but I like these. I use them with my cameras all the time. And yeah, it looks um, pretty decent. So I've got protective plastic on it. Yeah, look at that. Comes with a couple of spare rubber things for going over the corners of your phone. There's my other one on the Himalayan, the Ram mount. They're, they're good, but I want some more low profile for the Yamaha. Let's see where I can let's see where I can go. Go on there. There you go, that, that works pretty good. Nice for the maps to be able to turn it around. Alright, um... I didn't get a freebie or anything from these guys. It's a... Uh, I just bought it off Amazon, but I like it. I like it's low profile. Yeah, perfect. That's what I want it for, Google Maps. Yeah, perfect. I've got really good adjustability anywhere I want to put it. And these clamps, you don't have to worry about it being stolen or anything. These clamps come undone and you can switch it over onto another bike, your car, your lawnmower, whatever. And it was less than 20 bucks. How was that? <laughs> And I've got a ram mount on this bike at the much higher profile. Um, I like I got this one because um, they they got a good reputation. I don't know if you watch Max Risk Gold, but uh, old Risty there he uses these. He swears by them, and he gets up to a good old speed. All you know, 150 mile an hour plus. And it doesn't fly off his bike, so it should be good. Uh, ram mounts are good, I like the ram mounts, but like I say, I want low profile for this low profile style of bike. Cool, I'll use it on the push bike too. Alright, just a quickie, catch you later guys. I think Peanut went a bit too high. <laughs> you went too high, Peanut. There you go. Yeah. Good boy. <laughs>